Prime Month, y'all. Yes, it is June, aka Prime Month. One of the best times of the season, in my opinion, where everyone goes out as their identity or their sexuality. It's the best time. It's a free time. It's an epic time. You know what? I don't think we need this bag at this one. It's a free time. I got something better in store. We got. Woo! Yes, I got this in store. Just for this month, this is Epic Pride Baton or Thingy or Thing or Yes. <laughs> yes, it's Pride Month. I got something special. I got even this too. Little pinata thing and ah. Oh. Yes! Alright, <laughs> no silliness. Welcome to another episode of All About a First Studio, everyone. And this one, it is a Pride Theme episode. Yes, you heard me right. It is a Pride Theme episode. We are interviewing a transgendered fur, a really awesome fur, a really underrated fur, because it is underrated first tutor month as well for my YouTube channel. So I'm really excited to interview this person. Um, her name is Grovel Husky. She does a lot of awesome stuff. She does uh, news reports for the free fan of what's going on. She does amazing content and is just an amazing person in general. So without further ado, silliness aside, let's interview Gravel and get to know a little bit more about Gravel Husky. Woo! Prime Month, boy, yes. So the first question I have for you, Gravel, is how did you find the furry fandom? So I found the furry fandom with the help of a friend of mine. His name is Yaki. He invited me to go to a convention that was local to me called Further Confusion. This was back in 2017. I had no idea what goes on at a convention, so he showed me around, and as time went on, my interest grew. By the time it was summer 2018, I decided to make the commitment to go to a local event on my own, and I've been in the fandom ever since. So the second question I have for you, Gravel, is what are some of the best moments you've had while creating your content? Yes. Helping others discover what is happening in the community. I'm always happy that I'll get feedback from a fur either here on YouTube or on a different platform telling me that this is something that they never knew existed. And another uh, thing that I found out too was that I even had an organizer tell me when I did a shout out for their event, it actually helped their attendance numbers, which I thought was just amazing to hear. Now for the third question, and that one is, how would you inspire someone in the furry fandom? A community will thrive when there is creativity, and the fandom has a ton of that. If there's a talent that you share, an idea you feel might help others, an event you'd like to organize, then find what resources are around you and try to make all those things known. Now for the fourth question, as always, I always make it a little more basic on the fourth question, and, the, and that one for you, Gravel, is... What is your favorite beverage? It's gonna be this stuff right here. It's sparkling, it's a sparkling drink. It's a lemon beverage called Lemonada. I'm probably not even gonna try pronouncing that, but yeah, you can see it here. Very good stuff. And now the fifth and final question for you, Grumble, is as someone who is transgendered as yourself, or as the LGBTQ community, what are some things you'd want to say that would help impact their life for the better? Please remember that you are not alone. You will find friends in the fandom that will accept you for who you are and help you be the person you want to be. Thank you again, Benji, for having me on your, on your YouTube channel and Congratulations to your new milestone of over a thousand followers. I also am hoping I can bring up too that if you're interested in checking out my channel, just uh, look up Growl Reports. You will see me posting weekly. I want to give a big. I want to give a big thanks to Growl 
for being in this interview. She did such an amazing job. Seriously, go check her out. I'll leave her all the links in the description down below. Seriously, did an amazing job, Growl. Again, if you are in the LGBTQ community, you are special. You are amazing. You are valid. Seriously, you are amazing. You are awesome. I am demisexual myself and non-binary, and you guys are amazing. You are what makes the world go around. You are the next generation of amazing people. You are what makes this world special in an amazing way. Don't ever be doubtful of yourself. Be proud of yourself. Be amazing. You are amazing. You are proud. You are valid. You are the one. You are the chosen one. You are what makes this world go around. Don't ever doubt yourself. Please don't ever doubt yourself. And if you ever are struggling, we are we have your back. We always have your back. We are always going to be there for you. Furry or not, we will have your back. And if there are people that all don't have your back, drop them. Drop them. Like, they're not your friends if they don't have your back. A true friend has your, always has your back. And that's all I want to say. Again, check out Gravel Husky. She does some amazing content. She gives news reports to the furry community and updates you on the furry community. It's amazing what she does. And she definitely deserves way more support. So seriously, check her out. I'll leave the links in the description below. And I really do mean that. The furry, the LGBTQ community is amazing. It's valid. It's, it's amazing. So seriously, everyone in there is Truly, truly remarkable. So, yas, 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 yas. I really need to mean that. Um, I think that's about it for this video, though. I always want to do a pride, pride video, so I'm really excited to do one. Yas. <laughs> uh, I did do that dancing video a while back, but I don't really count that one just because... <laughs> oh, yeah. Anyway, <laughs> I'm really happy I got to do a really meaningful one this time, and I want to do this for a while. So, I, I thank you, everyone, so much for the support. It's so much support for the interview interviewers I've interviewed. So, again, thank you all so much. I hope you guys all enjoyed this. But as for always, I'm good, Joe. I'm good. Farewell. Thank you so much, Benji, for having me on your, on your YouTube channel. And thank you again uh, for having me. Wait, did I repeat myself twice? Yeah. <laughs>